All right, folks, buckle up because we're diving into the wild world of Ryan Garcia's roller coaster ride in the boxing scene. Just when you thought things couldn't get crazier for this boxing sensation, Ryan Garcia managed to stir up a storm of controversy that even his swift jabs couldn't dodge. From spats with fellow fighters to shocking remarks that left everyone's jaws on the floor, Garcia found himself in hot water faster than you can say knockout. But here's the kicker, the drama didn't stop in the ring. Nope. Ryan Garcia's mouth had a mind of its own when he made some seriously eyebrow-raising comments about Islamic boxers and even dabbled in some racially charged banter that had the boxing community reeling. And just when you thought he might tap out gracefully, the WBC president Mauricio Suleiman stepped into the ring and delivered the ultimate blow expulsion from the organization. Yep, you heard that right. The WBC had had enough of Garcia's antics and showed him the exit faster than a lightning-fast jab. Now, you might be wondering, what's next for this boxing bad boy? Will he bounce back stronger than ever, or is this the end of the road for Ryan Garcia? Stay tuned because we're about to unpack all the twists, turns, and ticos in this crazy saga. So grab your popcorn, folks, because you won't want to miss a minute of this juicy gossip straight from the boxing ring. Ryan Garcia isn't just any boxer oh no. He's been making waves in the ring for years with a record that reads like a thriller novel. From stunning victories to heart-pounding bouts, Garcia became a name to reckon with in the boxing world. But hold on to your gloves, because his journey took a sudden twist with an anti-doping violation that rocked his career to its core. And if that wasn't enough drama, Garcia found himself in the eye of a social media storm after making some, let's just say less than tactful comments about Islamic boxers. His remarks sparked outrage and debate, leaving fans and fellow fighters alike scratching their heads and wondering. What was he thinking? But here's where it gets juicy amidst all the chaos. Ryan Garcia didn't just stop at religious controversy, he waded into racially charged waters with comments that had everyone from fans to pundits gasping in disbelief. It was a moment that made you wonder, has Garcia lost his gloves, or is there more to this story than meets the eye? Ryan Garcia, already under fire for his anti-doping scandal, decides to stir the pot even more with some seriously eyebrow-raising comments about Islamic boxers. He didn't just dip his toe in, folks, he cannonballed right into hot water. Garcia's specific remarks? Well, let's just say they weren't exactly PG-rated. He made derogatory statements that sparked outrage across the boxing community and beyond. But here's where it gets interesting when confronted about his comments. Did he back down? Nope. Garcia doubled down, defending his words with a vigor that left many scratching their heads. Now, imagine being in the shoes of Islamic boxers like Devon Haney and Gervonta Davis, who found themselves in Garcia's firing line. Their reactions? Let's just say they didn't hold back. From fiery retorts to calls for accountability, the boxing ring became a verbal battleground. But wait, there's more. How did the rest of the boxing world react? Did they rally behind Garcia or did they throw in the towel on his controversial statements? It was a whirlwind of opinions, with fans and fellow fighters alike weighing in on social media and beyond. Let's talk reactions because Ryan Garcia's saga just hit a new level of drama. First up, Mauricio Suleiman, the big boss at WBC, didn't hold back when he expelled Garcia from the organization faster than you can say knock out his statement, clear as day. Suleiman dropped the hammer, citing zero tolerance for Garcia's controversial remarks and setting a precedent that shook the boxing world. But what about the contenders in this verbal match? Devon Haney and Gervonta Davis, two heavy hitters who found themselves on the receiving end of Garcia's verbal jabs, didn't stay silent either. Haney called for accountability, while Davis threw his weight behind Garcia, sparking a whole new debate in the boxing community. And here's where it gets really juicy amidst the backlash. There were whispers. Whispers about Garcia's mental health, his struggles, and calls for him to seek help. Was this just a case of a fighter losing his cool? Or is there more to the story? Fans and pundits alike weighed in, some rallying behind Garcia's need for support, while others condemned his actions outright. It was a showdown of opinions and emotions, played out in real time on social media and in the press. Let's talk consequences, starting with that anti-doping violation that threw his recent fight outcomes into a spin cycle. Garcia's victory over Devon Haney. Well, let's just say it got a major asterisk slapped on it when the results came back positive. That's right, folks, the boxing commissions weren't pulling any punches when they hit Garcia with a hefty suspension and some serious financial penalties. Ouch. 
But hold on to your boxing gloves, because here's where it gets even crazier. Remember that felony vandalism charge? Yep, you heard that right. Garcia reportedly went on a hotel rampage, causing over $155,000 in damage and landing himself in hot water with the law. And if that wasn't enough drama, throw in a dash of public intoxication just to keep things spicy. Now, you might be wondering what's next for the fighter once hailed as a rising star in the ring. Will he be able to bounce back from these legal haymakers and reclaim his place in the boxing spotlight? Or is this the final bell for Ryan Garcia's career as we know it? One thing's for sure, folks, in the world of boxing, the drama never takes a break. Let's dive into the juicy details of the public reaction and social media fallout. Twitter and Instagram were buzzing louder than a ringside bell with reactions pouring in from all corners. Fans? They were split down the middle like a perfectly timed jab some rallying behind Garcia, while others throwing in the towel on his career. But wait, there's more. Garcia's controversial posts and retweets, they were like throwing gasoline on a fire. From eyebrow-raising statements to retweeting fans defending his every move, he was stirring the pot faster than a celebrity chef on a cooking show. And the reactions? Oh boy, they ranged from jaw-dropping disbelief to full-blown outrage. Fellow boxers stepped into the ring of social media, some calling him out, while others offering words of support. Celebrities? They didn't hold back either, adding their two cents faster than you can say trending topic. But amidst all the chaos, one question remains, can Garcia weather this storm and come out swinging, or is he destined to be counted out? Will social media be his salvation or his ultimate downfall? We've got the inside scoop on Ryan Garcia's personal and family responses that's hotter than a ringside seat at a title fight. When it comes to family, they're usually the first ones to jump in the ring when things get rough. In this corner, Garcia's family stepped up with a statement that's got everyone buzzing. They didn't pull any punches, folks. They addressed his behavior head on, separating themselves from his controversial remarks like a tag team making a strategic move. But it doesn't stop there. We've got some deep cuts into Garcia's personal struggles. Mental health and substance abuse? They're not just background noise in this drama, they're part of the main event. His history with these challenges has been a roller coaster ride, and it's played a major role in his ups and downs outside the ring. Now, here's the million dollar question Can Garcia find the support he needs to bounce back stronger than ever? Will his family statement be a game changer or just another round in the ongoing saga? And how will his personal battles shape the future of his career? Now, let's talk family. When the chips are down, who's got your back? Well, Garcia's family didn't mince words when addressing his recent controversies. Their statement hit harder than a left hook, outlining their disappointment while trying to shield themselves from the fallout. It's like watching a family feud unfold in real-time drama at its finest. But wait, there's more to this saga. Behind the glitz and glamour of the ring lies a story of struggle. Garcia isn't just battling opponents in the ring, he's been in a ring of his own against mental health issues and substance abuse. It's a heavyweight fight against personal demons that's played out publicly, adding layers to his already tumultuous journey. Here's the twist, folks, can Garcia find redemption outside the ring? Will his family's public stance be a turning point or just another chapter in this roller coaster ride? And how will his personal battle shape his comeback story? So, where does Ryan Garcia stand after all the drama? His controversies have packed a punch to his boxing career, no doubt about it. From suspensions to social media firestorms, it's been a rocky road for the young champ. But hey, every champ faces setbacks, right? The real question is will Garcia bounce back like a true champ or throw in the towel? But it's not just about Garcia. His roller coaster ride serves as a cautionary tale for athletes and public figures everywhere. In the arena of sports, every move is scrutinized under the spotlight. One wrong jab, and the whole world's watching. It's a reminder that fame comes with a price tag, a big one. And speaking of price tags, mental health in sports has been thrown into the ring like never before. Garcia's struggles shed light on the pressures athletes face beyond the bright lights. It's not just about the physical grind, but also the mental toll that comes with chasing greatness. So what's next for Ryan Garcia? Can he climb back up the ladder and reclaim his crown? Will other athletes learn from his journey and take mental health seriously? The bell may have rung on this chapter, but the fight for redemption and awareness continues.